In the meantime, the Board of Tennessee State University has voted to end a buyout agreement with former President Glenda Glover. We learned today Glover's retirement package is worth more than $1.7 million. Now, board members voted unanimously Friday to urge interim president Ronald Johnson to end Glover's agreement. They say this was set up by the old board of trustees not long before state lawmakers voted to replace the entire board. We learned today that Glover has not one but two contracts with TSU. One of them was a buyout for her five-year contract if she agreed to retire early. The other was to continue working for the university as a president emeritus, helping to raise money and recruit new students. Under those deals, Glover would get just over $1.7 million over the next four years. Glover failed to mention the existence of the second contract when she sat down with News Channel 5 Investigates earlier this week, but she insists state lawmakers knew about the agreement. Glover says this is money she earned and continues to earn. There's no guilt feelings. You know, I have a retirement package. And is that somebody asked you, would you give us your retirement package? No. You don't ask a person to give their retirement package. They can't, that goes beyond the bounds of decency to ask me to give up a retirement package, especially if I'm still doing a lot of work for the university. Now, Glover calls these latest questions about her retirement package just another example of the state trying to distract from the fact it has underfunded TSU for decades. She says she has no intentions of going back on the agreement that forced her to step down as president.